Welcome to pre-math. In this video tutorial, I am going to show you super easy way to find the values of sine and cosine for various angles. And now I am going to show you how to create a trigonometric table for angles 0 degrees, 30 degrees, 45 degrees, 60 degrees, 90 degrees and their corresponding sine and cosine values and we are not supposed to be using calculators of any kind. And initially I'm going to show you how to find the value of sine of theta and here's the very first thing we are going to do. I want you to write down 0, 1, two, three, and four. And here's the next step. Let's go ahead and take the square root of each of these numbers. Let's go ahead and take the square root of each of these numbers. And finally, you divide each of these number by two. All right, all the way by and now let's go ahead and simplify these numbers. This 0, square root of 0 is same as 0 divided by 2 is 0. And this square root of 1 is 1. So this could be written as 1 divided by 2. And this one we are going to write as it is, square root of 2 divided by 2. And this one likewise, same thing, square root of 3 divided by 2. And here, square root of 4 is same as 2. And then divided by 2, 2 divided by 2 is same as 1. And as you can see that these values are same as these ones. And just keep in your mind that square root of 2 divided by 2 is same as 1 over square root of 2. And here I copy down 1 over square root of 2. Let me show you how to rationalize. Let's go ahead and multiply and divide by square root of 2 on the top and the bottom and this could be written as on the top 1 times square root of 2 is same as a square root of 2 and if we multiply square root of 2 times square root of 2 that is simply going to give us simply 2 and if you are wondering how did I get square root of 2 times square root of 2 here is my justification and it simplifies to 2 so therefore, 1 over square root of 2 is same as square root of 2 divided by 2. And now let me show you how to find cosine value. That's pretty simple. Look at this 0. We're going to go backward. 0 is going to show up over here. This 1 over 2 is going to show up right over here. This square root of 2 over 2 is going to show up over here. This square root of 3 divided by 2 is going to come over here and finally this one is going to come over here and that is exactly what we got over here in our trick table. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.